How do you refuel a hidden predator, an operation so risky it reveals its only vulnerability? This is underway replenishment. The submarine must surface, sacrificing its greatest asset, stealth. It now floats exposed, connected to a tender ship by thick, heavy fuel hoses. The process is a delicate ballet of seamanship between two massive vessels in open ocean. Rough seas are a constant threat, risking a collision or snapping the critical fuel lines. A ruptured hose could spill thousands of gallons of toxic fuel into the ocean. This environmental disaster would create a visible slick, betraying the sub's classified position instantly. The sub is also blind during this process, its sensitive ears compromised by surface noise. It is a race against time, typically taking three to five exhausting, high-tension hours to complete. Every sailor on deck is trained in damage control, ready for a fire or spill. The procedure is a testament to precise navigation and flawless communication between the crews. For nuclear submarines, they refuel only once, in a complex overhaul taking nearly two years. But for diesel-electric boats, this dangerous surface interval is needed every few weeks. It is a calculated risk, trading hours of exposure for months of continued silent patrol. So, is this surface rendezvous the most dangerous moment in a submarine's entire deployment?